and welcome back for another episode of Let's Play Shovel Knight Specter of Torment. I am, oh, pardon me, the Decepticon Gamer, and I am ready. I think, yeah, I would like to go go ahead and get Tinker Knight out of the way. We'll save Treasure Knight for next time. Shuck me into the meow. The Reaper cometh. Bring that money. I want to start buying cloaks. Because I've got almost all the curios. Yo! Ooh, that, I don't think I've I, I don't think I've generally used the spider scythe after I've gotten the upgrade for it. It's pretty cool. I can never remember. Is there a thing down here? Nope, apparently not. Ow. I love the music of this level. It can be a very frustrating level sometimes, but uh oh I don't remember that one being a bomb. Ow. I know well well yes, I am aware that the game has it is uh Strongly influenced by Mega Man in general, but uh, I don't know. I feel like this level has, uh, or the music in this level has a very uh, classic Mega Man feel to it. Oh, shit. Oh, that was close. Hmm. Bum, bum, bum. I, I really those those little robots are creepy. Haha. <laughs> yes, finally another darkness upgrade. I think I have one more of those. If I remember correctly. Ooh, nice. Waha! I'm sneaking through. Yeah, he, man, the other day I I went through on uh on my Xbox copy of the game. And uh, I was trying. I'm trying to get all the achievements in the game. Man, I, I did the checkpointless one. You know, honestly, wasn't that bad. But it was still. It, it was. It was something. You know, it was not easy for sure. There were certainly spots where I would have liked to have had uh, checkpoints. This level is definitely one of them. There are plenty of places to with which to die. Goodbye. <laughs> but yeah, the only thing, the only thing I've left to do on there for feats and or achievements uh, is the speed run, which I don't think I should have much of a problem. Um, my checkpointless run and what else did I do? Oh, I did the. Uh, the no, 
no darkness or will upgrade run and I think I both those were just under two hours and one was 159 the other was 155 and if I'm not going out of my way to to collect uh, like the skulls or anything like that because I was still doing that because I on the the one where I wasn't collect wasn't getting any of the darkness or will I definitely wanted to make sure that I had a Oh, that was close. Um, definitely want to make sure I had upgraded curios, so I had. Um, I think I got the majority of those, but it just it makes it makes it much easier when you can breeze through a lot of the levels and uh, and pass like certain encounters, like making sure that you have the darkness claw. I can't remember exactly what that one's called, but. I call it the, the Darkness Claw. I like that. Like, that term seems like it fits pretty well. But, yeah, I, I don't I don't really foresee a problem not being able to get it in, a, in an hour and a half. Oh, my God. This, these stupid gears. Damn you, gears. All right, that's not going to do me any good. this one. Yeah, there we go. I, I, I can see how you can do it without going back over there. There we go. Haha. <laughs> Whew. Ba -ba -ba, ba -ba -ba. Oh, come on. Damn jumpy guys. So are those guys all called gold armor, even though that most of them don't, or, you know, that only a part of them actually have gold armor? That's why I, I wish, like, during the credits, there was a, um, yeah, you know, like the, the classic, uh, again, referencing Mega Man, the, the, you know, where it, well, I guess not all of the Mega Man, I know that, I know Mega Man X does it where it has all of the... It gives you all the enemy names. Including, obviously, the the Mavericks. And, I mean, you get the you get the Robot Masters in... in classic Mega Man. <laughs> Darn conveyor belts everywhere. Alright, so do I have... 10 of 10. Sweet. Ba -doo -ba -doo. Stealing all the treasure. Oh, I missed. Oh, there we go. He's a sneaky little guy, that's for sure. I'm honestly not for sure if there's actually a, like, a one-hit 
I don't think I've tried all the curios on him before. Whoop. Gotta be careful of those. Of all the damn holes. Oh, oh, no. Eh. Eh. There we go. Ow. Yeah. Three, four. Boom. There we go. Haha. <laughs> A lot of times he, he like hovers right outside your range to where you get a dash, uh, a scythe dash. It can be rough trying to get past him. Oh, back to the past once more. Gotta get back, back to the past. Donovan Luan. Oh, whoops. I can already sense its power over life and death. It shall be ours soon. I don't, why does it even give you stuff? There's no enemies there. Seems kind of weird. Give me more of this paradoxical money. Burning it in the past. But uh, yeah, to, to, the, to that reference uh, that I made just a little bit ago, um, anyone anyone ha uh, having seen the newest uh, or if you've been watching you know, the Return of Samurai Jack, uh, I was quite pleased. It was overall it was a really good uh, wrap up for for a series that I've always enjoyed. Why well, can't I go over that? That seems kind of silly. Um, but yeah, I'm, I'm, I was glad to see that, it, you know, while I'm kind of sad that it it will go, you know, that it's, it's gone for gone for good now, um, I was still happy to see to see a conclusion to it after all this time. Oops. Haha! <laughs> do it is is that the amulet it's ours finally stay where you are that amulet has powers far beyond your control I am here to destroy it once and for all but I only seek I seek only to protect my son my intentions are pure protect him then by fleeing this place and never looking back <laughs> you want it for yourself I, you can't fool me Luan, would you do the honors? Uh, just a moment. If what she's saying is true, then might we be a bit more cautious? You would let some pompous knight tell us what we can and can't take? Who is this busybody anyway? I am Shield Knight, and I will not let you pass. Honestly, this this fight probably one of the uh, the harder ones to do with the uh, on the no no upgrade or not no not no upgrades but the no darkness will up, or because yeah, she's not like super tough or anything but. Donovan, the tower crumbles around us. We must leave at once. I never knew you as a coward, Luan. We'll leave once we have our prize. Stay away. You meddle with forces you don't understand. Please, Donovan, I'm begging you. Leave the amulet. It's not worth it. Never! Out of my way! 
And you, you won't stop me either. Oh, oh, and then, ah. Uh, bad things happen. No. I, I, I feel like... You know, that was a little bit too obsessive, but I guess that that's why you have the... That's why this this uh, story comes to pass in the, in the first place, so. All right, let's knock out this curio, and then we can uh, wrap this episode up. A very handy uh, curio, this one is, for a couple of specific sections. I do like the fact that you can basically just keep it going based, uh, essentially indefinitely. <laughs> And it will guard you against most things. Uh, however, you can't do a dash slash or a scythe dash when you have it active. So that's a little bit, you know, that that makes things a little bit more difficult. Oh wait, did I I think I just skipped over the dialogue for Tinker Knights. Tools of war can force a kind of peace, but I think our rules should be fair and just. None but fools would break things and not push, rush to fix them. Yeah, I, I'm pretty sure I totally forgot to uh, to read that dialogue. I got wrapped up in the moment. The barrier lantern. Okay, no more curios for now. All right, then I think we can go ahead and uh, call this. So thank you so much for watching this episode of Let's Play. Shovel Knight, Spectre of Torment, I am the Decepticon Gamer, and we will catch you next time. Bye!